else can you do to help prevent Alzheimer's? Simply learning a new language will help. When you learn a new language, you excite a part of the brain called the amygdala. Now, the amygdala is very active in children, young adults, as they learn. And then it gets less active as we age. And the, one of the reasons it gets less active is because we start doing a job and we learn that job. And we learn, learn the skills to do that job. And then we stop learning new things. It's the learning new things that gets the, amyg the amygdala active. And it's very important because the amygdala allows a greater um, connection to occur and a greater uh, creation of connectivity that we talked about earlier. Those connections in the brain that makes things work a lot better. Okay? So the second thing you can do, or the, actually the third thing out of the three that you can do is learn how to play a musical instrument or just simply sing. Um, music and certain kinds of music has the effect on increasing that connectivity, that neuroplasticity I talked about, which is so important in preventing brain degeneration and brain disease such as Alzheimer's or dementia. By doing musical activity, what you do is you can excite a part of the brain that is one of the early parts of the brain that gets affected by these diseases and that's the hippocampus, the temporal lobe, and basically the right part of the brain, the parietal lobe. It responds very well to music and it gets excited. Now, the brain needs three things to survive. It needs activation, and it needs oxygen, and it needs food, okay, and the right kind of food. What we're talking about is activation right now, and music activates your brain to the point where it likes it and it responds well and it becomes more active and the more active your brain is the less chance of you developing these degenerative diseases. So let's summarize the three things that you can do right now to help you prevent Alzheimer's. Number one is high intensity exercise and we talked about that in the last video. Number two is learning a new language. And it doesn't have to be, and you don't have to be fluent in it, just actively trying to learn the new language will help your brain. And the third thing is learn an instrument or sing. Both of the, those three things can actually help greatly in preventing you from developing Alzheimer's. Now, what can you do for your children? Simply, have them play a sport, have them learn a different language and have them play an instrument. Those three things will not guarantee that you won't get Alzheimer's, but what they will do is they will help you fight and reduce the possibility that you will get Alzheimer's. Remember, to live longer, you need to eat better and be active better.